Chloe here, how are you all? This week in my little studios, I have been making jeans, blue jeans, well, edible jeans, fondant jeans, um, I've been making this. I thought I would show it to you as a tutorial. I've really always struggled with making denim look realistic on a cake and it's really versatile to use. Um, so I thought I'd have a little play and this is what I came up with. Would you like to know? Would ya? Would ya? Stay tuned! Okay guys, this is what you're going to need to get started. For this tutorial I've used Spectrum Flow ethanol based colours, um, which is really important so that you can layer the colour nicely. Um, and what I'm doing is I'm just going to show you on a drum, but you could use exactly the same principle here if you were to cover um, a cake tier, so say you had a six inch round cake tier, you could cover it in white and use exactly the same method. Shake your colours really well because the pigment can settle to the bottom of the um, bottle. Um, and we're going to start by just applying um, blue with a little bit of navy thrown in. You can see it's patchy, that's intentional. We want to build up a depth of colour so I'm not looking for a smooth application. Toothbrush. A toothbrush just for sugar craft, not for brushing your teeth. It's the strands of these brush that allows you to create strokes, brush strokes, which is going to replicate um, those little itty bitty fibres that you get in, um, in denim. I go across one way, I spin my board around and then I come back the other way. Once we've created our crosshatch with the blue, we're going to go over and do the same with the white. I unscrewed the cap here so I can splatter the white paint, which I found gave me a, a more irregular effect. I go up and down one way, turn the board a quarter turn, and then go across the other way. Obviously, if you're doing this on a cake, you'll just have to do vertical lines and then go across and do horizontal lines. This is where the spectrum flow comes into its own. The white will sit on top of the blue. A regular water-based airbrush colour won't do that as easily. Now obviously denim has stitching, so I've used a stitching wheel. Um, while the fondant is still soft, I can create my stitching where I want it. This is just an example um, to show you what you'll find as you rub up and down that you will release some white from underneath, which is great. And I'm just using the edge of the stitching tool to create a little bit of torn texture in my denim. Then I am taking a scribing tool and I am just very, very gently removing some little bits of the blue colour to expose the white underneath and again to further enhance the fabric texture of the denim. I go across one way, turn the board and come down the other way again with the cross hatch. However distressed you want your denim is how much you will do this. This is up to you at this point. I'm going for a medium a medium distressed look, so I'm not going to overdo it, but I just want to show you what can be what can be achieved. You can pipe your stitching. You can colour some royal icing yellow. For ease, though, I've just 
taken some, um, I've got some Magic Colors Petal Dust here which I've mixed with Dipping Solution and I'm just painting inside um, of those indentations already. And I just want to show you here, obviously if you are doing a cake, what's going to make it look even more realistic is adding some pockets in, adding in some belt loops. Where that extra piece of material attaches to the jean, um, it will be more worn. So you can see I'm coming in and I am just taking away some of the, some of the colour to expose the white. Then I'm taking my airbrush and I am just accentuating a darker colour where the two pieces of sugar paste meet. That's going to again create depth. straightforward and uh, you know there are ways that you could change this up you can make it way more textured you could change the color and go for a stone washed effect you could get fancy with your stitching um, all sorts of things which is really going to add some character to your cake and you know without a huge amount of effort don't forget to subscribe guys no good me making these videos if you don't tune in and watch um, and obviously if you have any questions know my followers that know me know you can just send me a question whenever you want and I'll answer it as soon as I can um, and that's it happy blue jean making see you soon